<laughs> All right. <laughs> 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 Wouldn't it be great if Bryce just didn't show up the next week? <laughs> what the fuck? So I floated out there something that I've never done before. And and I don't want to hold anybody to anything that would make them uncomfortable. But, Wayne, uh, I did mention that one thing we've never done on the show is just straight up enjoyed a performance uh, from a close-up ma- magician. Would you be interested in being our first? Yeah? yeah? Okay. All right. Well, here, we'll, we'll, we'll set this up. <laughs> that title they just dropped. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's uh, see how we can, how we'll do that. Uh, yeah, let me get a... Uh... <laughs> what? Brett, what are you doing? What are you doing over there? What is going on over here? He's he's really he's really really excited about the sound of the cork and the whiskey that I brought. I brought a really good whiskey, and that cork just makes play the sound for for the audience. It's the sound is amazing. It really is best. Listen. Wait, hold on, hold on, real quick, real quick. <clears throat> Cargill, Cargill. I yes. know there's ten thousand doubloons on the other side of this ship. But we must very quietly walk from this side to that side to get them. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Cargo? That was you. Okay. Just very quietly. Just keep it quiet. <laughs> Definitely you. That's, I, okay, you can't call me before you even hear that it's me. <laughs> that was me. Okay, but it wasn't you. my fault. We were making a step. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Oh, is that, is that not the next one hour? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we got an hour in. Okay. All right. I, 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 uh, 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 Wayne, what would be a good uh, performance surface? What? He says nothing. All right. Coming up here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, Wayne Hoffman. <laughs> Oh, get a haircut. I feel, I feel like everybody left now. I'm, I'm here alone. Well, here, I, I need somebody to help me. I want to help. Here. <laughs> you're in. Come on. You're, come Does that on. sound really pathetic? Like, I want to help. No, please. Most help. of what I do is mentalism and mind reading. Yeah, you're, and you're gonna it's have boring a hard time. to stand here and read my own mind. There we go. Uh, so, um, hi. Hello. Are you ready? I am ready. All right, I got to warm up. Okay. I got to warm up. So, uh, where were you born? Uh, uh, Lafayette, Louisiana. Oh, cool. All right. Now, they say that, that uh, you can learn a lot about somebody based upon uh, where they were born. And it, and it says like a lot about their mentality and the type of person that they are and so on and so forth. So <clears throat> do you believe it's possible to predict the future? Yes. I say sometimes, yeah. right? Like we can predict the weather. We know at 5 o'clock on a certain day of the week in a major city – like Monday through Friday, the traffic's going to pick up. You know, we know when a hurricane's coming. We can predict things. You just have to have specialized knowledge, okay? So I have something. Did you see what I have written on this no, card? I you didn't. did not. Okay, good. I don't, I don't want you to see it. I realized as you were looking at it, I looked away. Okay, good. So don't, no cheating. No. I've written something here. Um, I'll tell you what it is. It's an amount of money. So what I want you to do is I want you to imagine you go to a convenience store, like a 7-Eleven type of thing. You go in. You buy some stuff, and you get some change back, and you get a receipt back. All right? Okay. No, no debit cards here. You're getting actual, you know, cash. How much change did you get back from your purchase? Make something up and just say it out loud. Uh, $3.75. Okay. Now, you could have set anything up to, I guess, a million dollars. I didn't really sure. give you a limit. Check this out. Read what it says. $3.75. Yeah. Right on the money. Literally. Wow. Three. 375. Can we get a zoom in on that? I did not see. (laughs) White balance. Yes. (laughs) White balance. Yes. A little bit of white. It's it's there. Like my hand. Just 
Yeah, is white. You'll have to trust. Us. Okay. It's there. It's three. So keep that throat away. Nobody Thank else is going to say that. I so <clears throat> now I want you to imagine you you go in, you you know you you're at this store, but you also buy a lottery ticket. Okay. All right. Picture the scene. You're there. Buy the lottery ticket. <clears throat> Powerball. You win. Okay, now yeah. you're set. You can do whatever you want. You could go anywhere in the world. Sure. Picture yourself. You go to the airport, right? You're about to get on a plane. You're going somewhere. Before I even do anything, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? All Viet expenses paid. Vietnam. All right, imagine you're there. Picture okay. the scene, the people, the vibe. I want you to go to an imaginary hotel, walk into the hotel, and go up to your room. On the door, there's a plaque. Tell me what room number is on the, on the plaque on your door. Make something up and just 112. say. 112. All right. Is that important to you? No. Okay. It's just like it's not you weren't born January 12th or anything yeah. like that. All right. You're not going to believe me, but in my shoe. I cannot believe this. I have a piece of paper. Check this out. In my shoe, piece of paper. Don't worry. My feet are clean. Take yeah. that. And I'm going to let you unfold it. And I want you to read out loud what I had written down earlier. Because I was originally going to say G, by the way. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Vietnam 112. Vietnam 112. Yeah, it's on there. It's right on there. Can you see it? That's too much time doing yeah, things yeah. you weren't supposed to as a child. I actually so. look pretty good on camera. There yeah, we go. That was, oh, that was I'm good. I'm keeping this. I'm yeah, keeping this. You got like a Santa vibe. Like, how many places are you going to pull shit out of? You know, I just don't... wait till you find where oh. Amsterdam 420 is hidden. <laughs> yeah. You know, nice. So uh, we'll try. We'll try something else. So okay. check it out. Um, are you a movie guy? Yeah, I'm a movie. Guy. Okay. So I made a list of the top 100 greatest movies of all time uh, yesterday. Actually, on the plane ride here. Okay. And uh, and for full disclosure, I didn't like. I didn't mentally make the list. I went on Google and uh, just down. The, you know, copied and pasted it basically. Sure. But I changed the order of them. Okay, mixed up the order, um, and then I renumbered them. There's 100, so 1 through 100, and they're all just randomized. So here's the deal. Uh, I want you to clear your mind, totally relax, like zone out. That's easy. It's easier for some than others. And in a moment, you're going to say a number between 1 and 100 out loud, and we're going to see what movie is on the list. But before you do, I'm going to try to make a prediction. Okay. All right? So just look at me for a moment. Stop falling in love. Too late. <laughs> I'm going to try this. Uh, let's go with. Ooh. All right. Let's do it. I'm going to say this. So this, uh, what I'm doing right here is I'm writing your future. All right. And uh, do this one live. So there's no question. Did you see what I had? I did not. You have no idea. No. I'll even let you hold it. Take it. That way you know I Thank can't you. sleight of hand it in any way. So. That's your, nice. that's your future. Nice. Wait, hold on. Hold Those on. that laugh have done hold it. A little bit. Thank you. Thank yes. You. Yeah. That is pretty good. Mimir okay. graphs better, but that's good. All right, we'll yeah. take it. <laughs> <laughs> he knows what brand is better to sniff. <laughs> You're like, yeah. All right, we'll go with it. Specificity. So, so uh, clear mind. Now, we all know there are statistically chosen numbers. Seven is a, is a popular number and so on and so on. So, you can choose one at random, or you can choose a number that's important to you. As soon as you have a number in mind, and you're dedicated to it, just say it out loud. 35. Okay. Now check it out. I'll, le I'll even let you do the honors. Here, you do the honors. Open up my notes right there. Notes. Yep. And then you'll see uh, a note labeled top 100 greatest movies of all time. Yep. <clears throat> and scroll through the whole list and go to the bottom. You'll see there's 100 of them, right? Sure. And, and none of them repeat. Read some of them off. Uh, American Graffiti, uh, Mutiny on the Bounty, Giant, Rain Man, definitely yeah. Rain Man. Definitely. definitely. Uh, but they're all over the place. Yeah, they're, sure. they're, they're just, and some of them I've never even seen. They're, they, they come <laughs> the pianist. Uh, yeah. Sorry. I, I, so yeah. <laughs> so uh, scroll, scroll around. What number did you say? I don't even remember. 35. 35. See what number 35 is okay. and then tell us. The Wizard of Oz. Okay. Classic. Yes. Um. <clears throat> Well, that's fucking weird. Give me my phone back and unfold the card. Number 30, yeah, 35 is the Wizard of Oz. 
get too involved. <laughs> the Wizard of O2. Yeah, Oz. Yeah. <laughs> the Wizard of Oz, right on the money. Bam. Boom. Look there is that. no place like home. There is no place. There's like no home. place like home. That's amazing. <clears throat> Zero places. Um, I'm gonna keep this as like well. home. So. Are you yeah. kicking me off or we don't? No, I don't know. You okay. tell me. How much time do I got? <laughs> but I, w I, wasn't, I wasn't told of, of my timing. Is that amazing that I, my brain can be read that easily? Uh, you know? I mean, part of me wants to just let you keep going the more you annoy yeah. Brett. Uh, but, but, <laughs> all done but now. But we could also call it a night. Yeah, cool. <laughs> I'm, I'm all done now. Thanks for letting Yay! me in your hey! yeah. Thanks. There we go. Yay! Yay! All right. Good job. Uh, Brett. Yes. We did a show without Justin. Yeah, we were, but we weren't going to get bummed about it. But you didn't do a show without a Robert. That's Let's true. think of it that way. That's true. You know true. what? That's a good That's point. That's true. I mean, if anybody needed to step in, someone with a glorious beard. Yeah. Somebody who you love. Yeah. Loves you. Uh, that has the same middle name. Yeah. Yeah. Who also wrote the... Doctor Strange movie. Sure. Yes, but both sinister, together. But also yeah. sinister. So. Yeah. And the Black uh, Phone coming January 28th, 2022. Uh, um, I, feel, I feel like we're only going to get no more trouble. So this is the part where we cut things dun, off. Dun, 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 this dun, is dun. where we thank C. Robert Cargill for Woo! joining us. Guys, thank you very much, Jomo. <laughs> thank you very much, Bonnie. Thank you very much, Brett Weaver. Yes. And chips, bitch. Eh. Chips, bitch. Mm. Just, just gonna say it one more time. Watch uh, Evangelion. Thrice upon a time. It's Friday. Amazon. It's good. It's good. You should watch it. I've heard. I've hear. I'm hearing it's good. Yeah, it is good. It's very good. Uh, we'll, we'll pick a title off the air, everybody. Oh, hell yeah. Alrighty. Well, uh, thank you everybody for joining us here on another great night. We're gonna take it offline. Uh, but, uh, as we go out, everybody, it's been a great night. Yay! Yay! Love you guys. <laughs>